Another big thing within Google Messages is actually the iPhone reactions. So if you're ever within a message with an iPhone user and they react to a text, and sometimes they can say liked by this person or loved by this person, well, sometimes that can be kind of annoying. So if you actually want to go ahead and pretty much enable those reactions as emojis instead of those little ticks or whatever, well, what you can do is you can go ahead and make your way over to your Google Messages settings as we were before. You want to go and click on Advanced Settings, which is right here. And when you're here, you'll see a ton of different things that come up. But right here where it says Show iPhone Reactions as Emojis, all you want to do is you want to go ahead and click on the specific thing and enable that specific setting. Now, what that's going to do is it's pretty much going to go ahead and anytime you get a text from an iPhone user and they actually like that message on iMessage, well, the fact that you have this toggle enabled, it's not going to go ahead and show you that little text within here saying, oh, this person, this message was liked by this person or this person loved or hugged, this not whatever it is. Well, it's going to go ahead and just show you that emoji over the bubble. And that's another really cool thing. You may or may not have to have you know, messages and the chat features enabled. Regardless, that's another really cool thing we have inside of Google Messages that, in my opinion, is actually really, really cool. Now, on top of that, if we